Hello and welcome everyone. One of the best thing about life is that we never have to stop learning. There are always new things to learn and new skills to learn and new techniques for us to adopt. To live life to the fullest, we must continually look forward to find something and to improve and enjoy life in each and every conditions. In this period of coronavirus pandemic also, I am so proud that there are my students who are looking forward and finding new ways to do the science, fun science store activities. And here is the first video in the Curious Clan series. Let's enjoy the video. Let me explain the chemistry behind the lava lamp activity. In the lava lamp activity, the student has used the effervescent antacid tablets. These effervescent antacid tablets, they contain the bicarbonate salt like sodium carbonate and the edible acid like citric acid or it can be tartaric acid. When these tablets they are put in water, in the presence of water, the bicarbonate salt and the edible acid which were already present in the tablets, they will react with each other to liberate the carbon dioxide gas and this carbon dioxide gas was produced as effervescence or they will appear as bubbles or they will appear as fizz and in the colored water when they will move up the carbon dioxide bubbles and they will pop up at the surface of the oil they will appear like a lava lamp and will give a very beautiful video. Good morning to all. I am Jatin Kumar of 8th B from DAV Public School and I am performing an experiment named as lava lamp. So let's begin. This experiment we need mineral oil, food color, some water and an empty glass. Pour mineral oil in the glass and fill quarter half with the water and now add food color in it i have added added food color into it now take three different tablets Break them into half and drop them into the mixture. It takes some time. After some time, it will look like this. It will happen when we drop two or three different tablets into it. It passes straight through the oil without any chemical reaction occurring. When it touches the water, a chemical reaction takes takes place which produce carbon dioxide gas bubbles. These bubbles are less dense than the water or the oil. So they float on the top. When they reach the surface, they pop and the water sinks back to the bottom creating a lava lamp effect it will look great in the torch i will show you how it is work in torch switched off the lights and put it the glass on the torch it is looking like a lava lamp i have made it <laughs> 